Hey guys, what's going on? It's October EMP. Uh, today I'm going to be showing you guys a neat little trick. It's um, how to fill in those that missing album artwork from your music library in iTunes. Um, the first thing I'm going to show you guys is how to separate all the music that has the missing album artwork from music that has al album artwork. So the first thing that you're going to want to do is go over to File and Add New Smart Playlist. And once you're over here, you're going to make sure this first box, you're going to want it to say where is it? Media Kind. And it's going to say Media Kind is Music. And then you're going to press this little Add button right there. And you're going to want this to say Has Artwork is false. After you do that, you don't have to touch anything else. Then you're just going to press OK. And it's going to give you a, a playlist of all of your music that doesn't have any album artwork. And I'll show you guys with this. As you can see, these are all songs that have no album artwork at all. So the first step that you're going to want to take Get It Back is right click and press, or actually, first you're going to want to select all, so press Control all and then press Get Album Artwork. It's going to take a few minutes to go through all of them and see which album artwork they can fill in for you. And I'll give it a second while it does this, it's going to take a couple more seconds. Now I did this already once, so it's not going to probably get rid of any of me. Before I had 284 and I went through this process and got rid of over 150 of them. So as you can see, it didn't get rid of many of them, but for you guys doing this for the first time, it'll probably get rid of around 75-80% to 80 of the music that you have that does not have artwork. Now the next step that you're going to take, if you want to fill in everything else that has artwork, all you have to do is find first um, separate the music by album art by the album. Then go to the first section and just find uh, I'm gonna find a random one. It's Dave Matthews. The name of the album is, is the best of what's around. So go over here. So just type in best of and all of it came up already. And then you're gonna wanna press Control All and you're gonna wanna press Get Info. And then this is going to come up, you can just say, uh, you can just press do, do not ask me anymore, say yes. And then, as you can see, right down here in the corner, it has a little box that says artwork. All you have to do is go into Google, search the name of the album by the person that you're, that you're trying to find it about, and copy the image, just right click and press copy on top of the image that you want to make the album artwork, and then come in here, check this off, right click, and press paste. And then it'll be done, and you'll have all the album artwork for that, for that song. Or for that album, should I say. And that's basically it, and you can just go through and you can do that with all of them. And by album, so you don't have to go through and individually do every one, specifically, and so on and so forth. And at the end, um, you might find that you have a bunch of random singles, um, that you know maybe don't have names or maybe it's your music that doesn't have a name it's just a number to it if you want to you know do all those and just put a you know a generic picture up as you know all the music that doesn't have album artwork all you got to do is um, when everything's all done just press control all do the same thing that i did before get info and then you can just go to, you can search any random photo and just like I did before, check that, copy the photo and paste it in this little box right here and it's that easy. It's a very neat trick that is very nifty and useful um, for people who use iTunes a lot, but that's about it. And if you guys have any, are you having any trouble with this, just let me know. Um, leave me a comment or send me a message and that's about it. I'll talk to you later.